Would you like to have fun, exciting, interactive gifts in your stream? Hey, it's the Dibs with Streamerology, and I did want to do an updated video, an updated version of how to get gifts in your stream on Twitch. From Mixer, we did bring a powerful tool. It's called Mix It Up, and it has a lot of options. It can do a lot of things. It's an amazing, wonderful tool. I wanted to redo the video because, first of all, I got a new API link. There was in the Discord for Mix It Up, they had a link for the API, which basically, if you don't know what that is, don't worry about it, but it's a link that makes it uh, filtered. So we have we have safe gifts. You can search safely for gifts now with the command for mix it up. And I wanted to go over it again real quick and kind of show you where to make it and how to make it. And we're going to check it out right now. So you can see here I have my mix it up application open. So you can see here I have my search gif. What I'm going to go ahead and do since we got the new AI API link before the link I used before in the previous video uh, had no filters. So followers, your your chat, whoever could type really crazy things in there and it would pop up some crazy gifts. We have a G rated version of that now. Um, and I decided to make an entire new video just because we have new information. We can uh, properly do this now. So I'm gonna go and make a command so you can see here and mix it up. We're making a new command. I'm gonna go down here. We're gonna choose, we wanna choose web request. So you're gonna choose web request here. You can see I select web request. We're gonna add that. Before we type anything in, we're going to get both. We're just going to get both of the components in here. So the next thing we're going to need is overlay. And sometimes, there it is, boom, overlay. So we're going to go and put that in here as well. The first thing we're going to do is put in our web request. Now we do have a new link. And I did get a, a brand new link to put in there. And I got our new link. I'm going to copy, paste that in there. It's going to be in the description below. So don't worry, don't fret. It will be there. You can copy paste this in here. You can also see towards the end of the API link, it has rating equal G. So the next thing you want to do is J S O N to special identifiers. And we're going to go ahead and type some stuff in here. Data backslash images backslash original backslash URL. The next to it, we want to type in text GIF. We'll go and type it in exactly as it is since it has if all caps, why not? We're going to add a new pair. You're going to do the new pair. We're going to type in data backslash title. And then on the next space, the special identifier is going to be title GIF. Now, this is what it's going to look like for the web request. Nothing else has to be entered. That's what you need. Now for the overlay, we're going to do HTML. And in the HTML text, we're going to be doing this. So you're going to type a bracket. So it's going to be shift, shift comma on your keyboard. IMG space SRC is equal to, and you put a uh, quotation here, dollar sign, text, GIF, GIF is in all capitals, quote, end quote, space, forward slash, shift, period. And you put in the other bracket. That is all you need um, for the HTML here. Now the next thing is you just have a you have placement here for the actual overlay where you can kind of choose and pick where it would pop up on the screen. Right now we're going to leave it centered. I'm going to drop in 8 seconds. You can choose animations. You can do fade in. We'll do a fade out downwards and we'll do a what do we want for a video animation? We'll just do a uh, we'll do a flip. So the next thing is to make sure before you save we need to make sure it has a name. It's going to be searched GIF, and the command is going to be GIF. So you don't, and, and mix it up. Here's an important thing in mix it up. You don't need to type exclamation point. It automatically puts an exclamation point in there for you. So after you type in GIF, go down here, click save. Of course, the reason that didn't work for me is because I already have the command in here. So I'm going to do search GIF 2. We're going to save. And <laughs> it doesn't like it because I have, all right. It doesn't like it because I already have a command named GIF. So I'm going to put in here just GIF2 as an example. We're going to save it. Boom, it's saved. So you can see here I have my search GIF and my search GIF2. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and deactivate mine, my original command. We're going to leave this one up. 
We're gonna go ahead and type it in chat. Exclamation point gift two nerd. And ba boom. There you have it. That is a fun and easy way to get gifts on your stream to be interactive with chat. As you can see, I am uh, now an affiliate on Twitch, so I got the subscriber here. I've set it for my subscribers only as a feature for people who sub to the channel. Uh, you can do the same thing as well. If you go back to edit command, you have those options up here under permissions. You can do it for anyone who's an affiliate, partner, follower, VIP, subscriber, mod, etc. You have a lot of options here for permissions. You can put timers on it here as well if you're not familiar with Mix It Up. So you can create a per person, per group, per individual. You can create groups for cooldowns within Mix It Up. All right, and I hope this video clears things up. The first one wasn't as clear. I went ahead and did a second video since we got a new link. We got a lot of new information. Basically, we perfected this so it is friendly and it won't pull anything up inappropriate on your stream. It's G-rated. It's from a safe search list off Giphy. So we did get that API link, which is fantastic. If you have any questions about Mix It Up, if you have any questions for your stream, do let us know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe. We'll be putting out more videos for microphones and cameras soon. We're also going to be doing gamer news. We're going to be doing some gamer videos. We're going to be doing uh, things about streaming as well. So if you have any questions, technical, anything in general, really, just let us know in the comments down below. I'm now streaming on Twitch. You can catch me Wednesday and Friday starting at 4 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. You can also catch me on Saturdays at 12 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. And come ask us any questions you might have. We look forward to seeing you, and I hope this video enhances your stream. Thank you so much.